Not bad, Marcus. <sighs> but we're going to have to get the excess stone and powdered and shit out of there. Maybe it can be thrown <laughs> in the water, like you said. Right, but my gods, my lord, likewise. <laughs> you still fucking got it? <laughs> Look at you. Holds a whole garrison for a week and then can still <laughs> dig like a madman. I've done the bare minimum. <laughs> Very I've well. My mind occupied. Right. Pretty yes. The last we of still the got the. Mm -hmm. Can we look at what we have left? Whew. Okay. <sighs> if you're ready. <coughs> How goes the work? Pretty good. They finally got it open, so they're checking it down there to see if it's still intact. That's good. Anything from up there? Present? Not since last night, the trouble I saw earlier in the night. Oh? Yes. I saw a rogue figure hopping from the rooftops. Didn't get a good look at them, but they were very agile and fast. Hmm. Are they by themselves or with other people? <clears throat> I only saw one, but he was watching, I think, me for a moment. I only just saw him out of the corner of my eye. Then there was another one. I saw him. It looked familiar. Bore a mask and two blades. Mm. But they weren't showing particular interest in the house, were they? <clears throat> well... I think it's still a concern. Well, considering we haven't moved anyone here yet and treatment hasn't even started yet, it'd be strange if they were curious. Unless word has spread that If quickly. they've heard anything... Exactly. Then each one of us as well are target of interest. <clears throat> Stay in groups, I guess. Hmm. I always assume you're being watched, is also an opinion of mine. Fair now assumption. Arn and Marcus just went down. Wanna go check on him? <sighs> By your leave. I will leave. I'll make it my personal uh, duty here. Oh. Oh, we're in here. <sighs> Most of the old basement's been cleared out. Well, there's plenty of soil coming in through the cracks in the walls. Marcus has a few ideas to deal with that. As long as it keeps people out, it doesn't need to be pretty. My only issue is, if this exists, this close to the coast, then that means people have been tunneling all over the city, perhaps, there's, since there's plenty of room down below. So I'll have to check to make sure there are no hollow points if someone <clears throat> tries to somehow dig through into here from somewhere else. Or well, something. Just check our walls, but you bring up a good point. I wouldn't be surprised with a couple of tunnels rain if there wasn't some sort of smuggling ring oh if there's a smuggling tunnel that goes right next to us i mean we'd be the first to find out great that's a nice thought to have mm. i'm just making sure uh... <clears throat> once things are stabilized the politics of the county can focus on clearing out the underbelly but for now <clears throat> hands are tied 
Uh, but I keep start examining today, and I'll keep a look on uh, Miss Nora while she's with us. I don't mean to be smart, but who's watching her right now? Oh. Well. It's looking good. It is? Mm. <clears throat> it's not pretty, but it would look do. Like it's, it's, it look like it's still stable down there? Yes. <laughs> Stable's a word for it, I guess. We have some sure, concerns, but... There's three antechambers. Okay. okay. Who knows what's going on? Yeah. Ah, yes, forgot for the last thing. Mm. I forgot to mention you again. <laughs> there was a fire that broke out last night. A fire? Where? <laughs> Place looks great. The walls are. It's gonna need a lady's touches in it. Marcus. <laughs> a few of the guards yes, got injured. I don't know if there was any casualties. Can you watch her for a minute? I need to do L. Needs to show me. Of course. Lead the way. Right, I should put that down. <laughs> <clears throat> That's somewhat concerning. Now you understand why I was more con concerned with the figures. Mm-hmm. <sighs> They were saying they were blaming the hero of Nautus, apparently, had started the flame. But the way that everything ex expanded as it did, it's puzzling, to say the least. Even if it is dry wood. You said some of the guards got, uh, hurt. Yes. Some of them were very burned and in torrid condition. I'm not sure if they survived. An accident or arson, you think? I left the sergeant here to investigate. I told him to double check everything, to be sure. They say it was, uh, well, done by him, so I guess it would be less, say, an accident. <clears throat> Kyler, as you look around, you notice the a lot of the scaffolding is collapsed and burnt and trampled into the ground. It's going to take days to replace all this. The damage is extensive in this section of the walls. <sighs> That's not good. Morning, Arco. Be free, free. Fui fui. Bloody snick of snickering. <clears throat> Do you have any idea who was responsible for this? Who did it? Short. Round. Were they blonde? Hero of Nautus. Mm. <clears throat> Do you know where he is? That's what some of the gods were saying. No. Last I saw, he made a break up into the mountains and stole a cart and ran off into the distance. He fell off. <sighs> ran away from the gods. He fell. <clears throat> People came around. And 
the fire went off. Okay. Well, I suppose... Guards are looking into it. This isn't something we need to particularly worry about, though we do need to stop by the tavern. I had some disturbing news yesterday. Oh? I'll tell you when we get there. Good morning, my lord. Morning. Mr. Mr. Aegon, good morning. Well, as well as it could be anyway, I'm... I don't know if you know anything about, about this, but... Hey, um... Room, I I've been right. meaning to uh, approach you, you can, and uh, uh, apologize for my behavior just... on the contract. I don't know when they're coming. I don't know how many. Mm. All I do know is they're eventually going to go. It won't happen again. Oh, Lord, Lord of Hearts. Morning. Mind if I talk to you for a moment? Your motives are your own. Uh, certainly. Um, Currently, my back room is being utilized by Torty, Hopper, and I believe it's Sarah. <coughs> if you don't mind budging on them, otherwise we can go upstairs to my office. Either or, I just need to inform you about something that you probably already know about, but I need to do my due diligence. Encountered rangers on the road. Very well. Um, perhaps we can step inside. I believe it's going to be, yes, in regards to the same thing. <clears throat> watch the bogger, Bond. It's all right. Thank you. I doubt when they attack. <clears throat> yes. I hope you don't mind Hello. if we. Drug gang, drug gang. Very Very hot yes. <laughs> I imagine it's going to be <clears throat> something similar. I wanted to make mm. sure that the word got to you of a potential attack on the tavern today, but I assume that's what you're talking about. Yeah. Good. My lord. I had been informed last night. Good. Like I said, you probably already knew, but I wanted to make sure. Just doing my due diligence. Do we have a plan of defense? Of Do the guards know? We don't know <sighs> if uh, some of the guards might be the corrupt ones. With it, all we know is there's people in town that are ready for this plan. Apparently, I have not informed them myself either. Uh, according to them, it could be as many as a few dozen, and they could all come at once. And we don't know when they exactly <coughs> are coming, only that they potentially are. And on top of that, I have another shipment coming in today of goods. So, so Hopper timing. did bring up a point that apparently they don't care for imps and stuff. So if we maybe like say, hey, I'm imps, half off food today to motivate them to be here more often today, maybe they can help defend without drawing their attention. I suppose, but I'm just concerned that any changes to the norm it's going to alert whoever's trying to put this on, and then they're going to try to do something more subtle. Not to mention Things you'll be plans. showing a lot of favoritism to the Imperials. Still that some and many who are not happy about that. Mm -hmm. As it stands, we know what the plan technically is, and as dangerous as it sounds, as long as they don't change it, we know what's coming. And at that least, we can anticipate what they're going to do. Best not to tip them off. Hopefully. Yes. <sighs> All I would ask of anyone here is that... Just be ready at the moment's notice if word starts spreading <clears throat> that there's a riot at the tavern. We'll come as soon as we can. We're 
quite preoccupied suddenly, but... Yes. Of course. Some of us will be ready. Yes. That is certainly appreciated I'll tonight. make it my uh, duty to stay between here and my workshop, so... I'll be within yes. the range. I do need to go to the vineyard at some point today, but that's as far as my plan is. <clears throat> right. Would you prefer me to tell some of the more Regardless. trustworthy guards, or should we keep it quiet and just let them come in and help as needed? <sighs> I agree that tipping them I off is... Do you, have... My lord, but... Do you have contact mm. to the custode? Because he would be the one to know if who's his, his loyal man, you know? From my understanding, my lord, I understand the keep is still in a bit of a ruckus in regards to the Baroness. Yes. Uh, it's a little difficult. I have an idea of a couple, but... <clears throat> oh, you didn't hear. Um. No, uh, well. I went to bed very early yesterday. Oh. Oh. Fenora got oh, arrested uh, for what? suspicion of trying to kill the Baroness. Yeah. <clears throat> She's she like still... comatose now or something? Is she still alive? alive? We can't discuss this any more than what's happening. This can't leave this room. Venora is currently on house arrest, i.e. she's under the Erhard's protection. We're going to be looking after her. She's not going to be leaving our side, uh, our eyes, and essentially no one is going to be going into the house to talk to her. The doors of the houses will be locked. You won't be allowed in unless you're escorted by one of us, and any conversations in there will be accompanied by us, just so you're aware. <clears throat> and this doesn't leave this room. Unfortunately, with things that are happening, our enemies can capitalize on it, and if they do, then it's game over. Like, that's it. So I'm not taking chances about who we talk to about this. Understood? All right. Yeah. Understood. On that yes. note, is there a chance that I'd be able to talk with her? With any of you guys later? What do you need? <laughs> um, well, I was gonna ask to maybe go up to the vineyard. I kind of have free roam of it, just to go look around for anything. I just want a little bit more information. Like <laughs> Venora was arrested in the vineyard. I don't think she would be able to let you in there. <clears throat> no, I have free range of the vineyard. He wants to go extra evidence to help her in the situation. It's at... People approach me just asking if I could go up. It's at the point it's, mm -hmm. it's less about evidence now. I don't think evidence uh, helps the case. What did, <clears throat> what did she give her? She came into possession of something odd that she thought might cure the Baroness of her condition. Unfortunately, when she gave it to her, she started seizing that's when she was arrested. The Baroness is currently in a coma. That's the last I heard. <laughs> it's important that I really enforce this, that right now we're on top of it as best as we can do. We don't need any extra, extra outside help or anything. We have a plan going forward. And anything that changes puts everyone at risk. <clears throat> I'm not saying this to be an asshole, but people's lives are now in danger, and I can't risk it anymore. Yeah. No, certainly. <clears throat> well, um, to circle back around to why you're here, my lord, uh, of course. if you wish to tell your more trusted <clears throat> guards, I'd leave that up to your discretion. Just that every single person we inform, as you just detailed, puts our current knowledge of the situation at risk. I'll hold off for now. That way... Yeah, they have no real way of knowing. <clears throat> Hopefully. Yeah. Well, we don't really know anything, so all they can do is assure us all that they would come when called, just like anyone else here would. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we'll keep our ears open. If we hear something, we'll 
come as soon as we can, but again, our priority is Venora right now. Yeah, you I, have my thanks uh, I don't think I can risk doing combat in the fucking town. Out in the woods is different. If I can maintain distance from them. If you stay in your usual perch, you'll have a good view of everything. <clears throat> the the chick goes sideways. I've if they get inside... Coin. If they get inside of here, though, and someone gets cornered, I can't risk it. No, of course not. I wouldn't ask you to do so. I've locked most everything up. So, if they really try and break in here, I will sell myself dearly if I have to. Where is the location of the stuff they are searching for? I know what to protect. I can find a... Find it's the best thing here. I have all my food in stuff here. stored... Yes, crammed into the storeroom. They're after the food, apparently. They want right. to burn it and make people starve, which would be a very big problem. That's quite silly, considering the ports have opened up again and we're getting supplies again. Yes, they think they but we wouldn't get attack the tavern, make angry, starving people that will riot against the odds. Yes, I, I supply a good deal of meals throughout the day, and if. I can't get food in fast enough through the ports and from the farmers, and people are going to starve nonetheless. That makes people angry, makes them destabilized, and then we're back to square one. Right. Okay, well, I'll leave this to you guys. If you need our assistance, you know where to find us. We'll do what we can. Of course. Good to see all, all of right. you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Somebody. Aguera. Uh, uh, we're just talking. Oui. Hmm. May I have a meal, please? <laughs> yes, of course. What's the total? Apparently, he's looking for establish a form of security and normalness, but even then, underneath the ice. I'm not sure why he's looking for me, but um, I wanted to talk to him. I am seek a little bit of help from him. Everything okay? You wouldn't hurt anything. No. Um, but there's plenty more to worry about besides that. If you want to talk. I feel like you both would be mildly interested in what I have to say. Don't expect yeah, you to be able to help. I mean. What the fuck? <clears throat> but yes, right. I don't think you'll be able to say much about it, but at least we know what's I need going to talk on. To someone. Uh, let's go to your house. Actually, since hmm? our house is, you know. Yes, and let's grab Soma. Do you want to run in and check? Let's go. Make sure everything's okay while I do this. You can come back to me afterwards. Very well. Look as you should. According to Venora, if someone's framing her for something, we should know. Yes, you should know. But you shouldn't worry about it because there's not exactly much that we're capable of doing. That's it. We could find out who tried to frame her, though. No one. Don't get involved, basically. Are you sure the Imperials didn't? Is where we're at with this, Tang. I need you to enforce that to them. You know what's going on. I'm aware. That's what I'm trying. 
Good to see you. We've been told by multiple people who do know what happened. Good to see you too. Don't worry about it. She's fine and nothing else. Look out that Solon sort of thing. She wants to make the idea. Morning, Summer. Morning. It's your business. Get comfy till I get God. <laughs> I understand. He's talking to Schmear and Schmel. And with a wang, he'll oh, pee pee for us off. <gasps> Not Schmear <coughs> and Schmel's pee pee. Okay. I have gathered you here today to speak about the most recent terror I've experienced. I guess. Just when you think it's over. Yesterday, Lisa. while I was walking with you near the docks, kinda, I heard a voice. Like it was right behind me. I turned around and there was nothing there. It was coming from inside my head. It was very brief. It said, seek us. Save us. Find us, underkin. Underkin is a term only used by creatures and people of the Underdark. I wanted to tell you this because I know you've experienced something similar that is also from the Underdark. Am I correct? Other than the disease of which you and I both know, do you think it's the shroom lung, then? But I was cured. <clears throat> I can't I'm going to be honest. I'm going to be honest. I have no idea. And I do not know if I'm even comfortable explaining it when they're around. They're going to be new to this. I smelled. I have mind. What? Hold I'd on. say they're harmless, you hear that? but someone slipped. <clears throat> Just goes to show how loose lips are around here. So what I was talking about. They don't earlier. know what it means. They've been told not to say it as well. No, but the Inquisitors will know about that. God damn okay. it. Every fucking time. All right. I don't really expect to anyone know. to have advice for this. I don't even know how to explain it myself. I don't have advice, happens. but I have theories. I don't have advice, but I have theories. But before I continue right on, we need to explain to them that there are certain words that they cannot fucking say. Because if there are certain things that are said outside of here, we, we all know. Everything will go down south in this town if it starts spreading. Arca, behave. 
Out of mind. No. Correct. A couple of weeks ago, there was um, a few eventful encounters that I've had, about two or three of them. One of which I can blatantly remember when Basil was with me. Basil luckily was with me when I started hearing shit again. Again? I know some things oh, about the Underdark. Of what... Ledford. <laughs> you really think that it stopped at Ledford? I, I thought it was Risa. Unless... No, no, thing. no, that's... No, no, it's something else. Something much worse. A few visions have happened, and this one I remember the most. Especially during a nightmare. A nightmare that consisted of one said hive mind that... Like, like a speaker. Basil was with me, and we walked up to the lighthouse. That was where it was the strongest. Up the very top, I saw a vision. Hundreds, maybe tens of thousands of shroomhunk. And even some in the distance of old friends. It sounded like a through 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 the eyes of another that was giving out or that was giving out orders to spread to continue spreading through towns and cities underground i th think it's only a matter of time however what i didn't realize is what basil heard what it was repeating through that vision is what i was speaking of she literally heard the, the voice and its words through my own. It made me try and walk over the fucking lighthouse, and thankfully, if it weren't for Basil, I'd probably have fallen on the rocks. And that's what I was scared of, so this voice you heard was capable of controlling your body. I've tried within myself to try and adapt to it. Or at least try and survive whatever it was throwing at me. But right now I fear the... What gets me the most is that these visions are much clearer when I'm near the water. The ocean. Whenever I am near it, something happens. Which that shouldn't Maybe be the only thing to be scared from. about. Wouldn't that I do suck? not. <coughs> I'm. Yes, yeah, soccer sharks. You were having these sharks. theories before the stalwart went down, right? This is all before the stalwart went down. Way before. Mm. And again, you really think that it stopped there? Well, I can't let it get to that point. I can't. Authority. Not in control of one. This is, assume me, it's the same thing. Force. We've actually seen possession like this twice from two different entities, remember? This one was pleading with me. It didn't seem... Hmm. the same. It seemed like it genuinely needed my help. And if it's from the Underdark, and it's pleading for help. And I can hear it up here. That's either going to mean one of two things. It's up here where it shouldn't be. Or it's down there and it's dying. And it expects something like me to help. I wonder what the connection you have with it is. If it can enter your mind. I asked Tiberius. He said he didn't hear it. He was right next to me. So it's... It has to... Probably has to do with blood. I don't know. I do know that I don't have time for this. <laughs> Genuinely. 
You're right. I can't offer any advice to help. The only thing I would say is if you choose to do something, come and get us and we can help you as best as we can. There have been too many instances of people running off and trying to do their own thing and ending up in trouble. So, come and find me if you need it, okay? Sure. I will say this. We may not have time for it now. Due to the rubber baron and everything else coming across. Sooner or later, this shit's going to catch up with us and we need to be prepared for it. Even if we are, one theory that scares me the most is this. If those armies come through those waters, we will not be prepared for what's coming up. Nautis will be lost. <clears throat> I really don't want to deal with shrooms again. I don't fucking either. And at this point, I've been dealing with them for so many fucking years. One thing at a time, yeah. Robber Baron. Robber Baron. It's the only way I'm gonna keep I my actually, head on straight. <laughs> I actually need to get updates on that, on how that war's going. Uh, there was an offensive yesterday. We pushed them back past the embassy, which we now own. There is a small contingent of them holding out in the Cross Keys Inn, but we've more or less encircled them. We've pushed them nearly all the way to Telor Keep. Well, the Imperials have. That's why we have so much breathing room. Oh, they that's close. <laughs> yes, that's why we have the breathing room, and that's why we're getting more uh, trade coming in from the docks. So, if you excuse me, I need to go check Thank on gods for that. people in you know where. I want to come with you. The less people oh, wait, I can't. Never mind. The better. I'll come and find you later. <laughs> yeah. Come on, Akka. I know. That all of them, even knowing the risks, of oh, uh, your father and do Mando is upstairs. Do they need me? I don't know. Seems that they're having, they're having a private conversation. They both ushered each other off. There are <coughs> many things Fair I regret, enough. Arnulf. Any news from the other front? But leading them down there is not one of them. Troubling news from Sarah, but nothing we can handle right now. Anything nothing from the tavern, and nothing the from the hunt for the hero of Nortis. The most All quiet on the Nortis front, I should say. So, I oh. ask that you do How about in here? <sighs> Despite the loss. Despite the hurt. Well, uh, nothing's changed, really. Not been changed dealing with the rubble. <clears throat> I had to find out. I had done something for Jensen in confidence. He made me a promise I'd keep my mouth shut. And how are you, Venora? Rain, I know. I'm doing good. Just taking a little bit of breather while I eat my morning soup that Daniel brought me. <clears throat> Your tribe is getting a little restless. Tang is trying to convince them to not try and poke their head into things. And I reinforced it by saying, we're on top of it. <clears throat> the more outside forces that act on this, the worse it's going to get for everyone. So hopefully they understand that Tang's doing his best. Yeah. 
Well, I told Miss Lorelei when she goes to the Grove to have <clears throat> Galel stop by and visit. Dear God, so you can conversate with him, so he can get them, their, keep them busy with the training, keep, keep them preoccupied with other busy, things. Mm -hmm. But I'll let you, when he comes here, kind of talk with him. Yep. Do you need anything from the Grove <clears throat> to help with what you're doing? Uh, no, I don't think. But you are, you are young. I don't think any of Goldrick's gifts are going to help me on this situation. I can't exactly find Zeph and bring him here. Do you have a plan of attack on this? That's why I'm reading. <clears throat> Cross referencing everything that we've been through since Ledford. The first time. It everything is. that I've taken down. It is important that you check everything twice before trying it on her. Hmm. Oh, that's a, oh, that's a good idea. That's what I want to ask you. I wanted nothing more than to disappear and give up. She flips through the pages because I gotta look this up real quick. Second, so okay. Family, I'm afraid mm -hmm. for my friends. I'm afraid for you. And my time and my strength is waning. It's nothing that I can do. Um, if you can get a hold of Soma, on, or if we can visit the Merchants Guild, we need to Listen, pick up some Soma. poison testing kits. What do you hear? If there's certain items that I need, and we get it from outside sources that I am unfamiliar with, unless it's close friends of ours, we might need to test need some us. things. The voices, the humming. Make sure it's not been poisoned or altered or anything. Okay, I can talk to Soma when I see him next. All here. Okay, uh, other than that, I will start looking through my notes, see what kind of, of herbs I need to get stocked because with. Because I can't. Shoulder in this burden <sighs> Under house arrest, that means I can't even go outside the walls with our armed guards to go pick herbs, right? On. I would advise heavily against it unless it is completely necessary for the treatment. You have to remain here in town. Just because we have to stop by. Okay. If there is someone well, who could do it in your stead. Um, um, sake that which still um, seeks to do good. Oh, Sean, oh, maybe. Shanta. Yes, it's scary. It's beneath you. He yes, dropped it. <clears throat> yes. Oops. Uh, oh, Sean could definitely. Whoop. Oh, Sean could do it for me. I can ask him. If not you, look okay. up what herbs I need not and have if him you go gather for give me. Give me a list. I can get it to him. Okay. One moment, then. Also, I'm going to need another healing potion. I had to use mine yesterday. I don't know if that's a possibility. I know that there will be a point where... Um... I will have to say goodbye. In the crate here, when we picked up my current inventory, other than him going to get in the... the faces quick that line. Oh, or did you already get it? Through death. Mm -hmm. okay. Age... Ah, mother sorts of I will horrible write things that we have encountered, or... In here, I have five Just tier two healing potions. Do you mind if I take one? But I'm resolved that until that point, I'm going to continue fighting. With everything that I have. It's this one, isn't it? I can never fucking tell. Yes, the red. Mm -hmm. you, you know how easy it would be for you to poison <laughs> me? <laughs> you could just tell me it's a potion, and I'd be like, sure. Oh, Please don't say that. <clears throat> Thank you. You're reading my mind. Don't put those thoughts in your head, okay? <laughs> you ever get tired of me? That's a selfish ask. What? What? Uh, that's how knock, I feel. knock, knock, knock. You didn't do that mind melt thing while I was sleeping where you knew what I was gonna say, right? No. Okay, good. I'm not that type of person. Um, right, so let's see here, so... With uh, my roll... I don't let me see... I 
by some graces of whatever conangling deity sees us mm. successfully. Uh, my lord, you have a visitor? Contact reasons. <laughs> we don't let people inside the house anymore, Marcus. Oh, God. Ah, right this way, sir. You'll see something bundled and wrapped around his chest. I know I... Well, I haven't really been myself as of late. Hmm. Then I want to say sorry for all that. I don't really know if I will be myself completely. At least not until I can figure this all out myself. It's not about me, Ro. It's about her. Listen. I know. I'm gonna figure it all out myself, but... For the time being... I need all the help I can get. Whether it's from friends or family. That that being said, I heard something has to happen to Gerbon's tavern today. Can you at least watch over over her for the night? I can keep her safe. This for the place night. is now a target, but I can do what I can, I can try. If it's too great of a risk, then don't worry about it. There are plenty of people here I can trust. Someone might be able to look after her. I can't go into details, but if this is where she needs to be, then I can look after her. I understand. <clears throat> well, I heard about what happened yesterday, even though I might have not been fully there. Yeah. Will everything be all right with her? We're trying. We have to keep an eye on her. Things are happening that if the wrong people hear about, then that's it. So we're very tight lipped. I understand. Don't worry. <sighs> Come on. Let's go get you fed. <clears throat> Thank Just you. Again. Bring her around when you need it. I will. No one's seen Marin by chance. Marin? Oh, God. I don't want to think about it. Yeah. No, I haven't. Marin. Sorry. Shit. <laughs> it's okay, it's not important. I have plans, I have blueprints, I, I thought of something cool last night, and I want to start it. But I can't, like, finish it anyway, so it's like... Did you look into that yeah. thing I talked about? That's a thing that I drew up yesterday. Oh. Yes. Okay. Yeah, the, the problem with it is that it needs, like... Having one helpful thing on you is easy enough to protect and stuff. You fall on it, you can angle yourself right. just fine. I, if I make a specialty bag, I, I could, you know, make a specialty one that has like two, you know, pretty good fist size slots in it, right? Um, but you fucking crush it, it's gonna be bad news. So now I have to go through all this extra effort to make sure it'd be safe in pretty much any situation. So I would need something really durable. On the outside, soft on the inside, I'd need to treat it. I'll use my alcohol for that, no issue. Um, but yeah, so like, I need something special, like, 
orc skin or squid skin or something like that for the outside. Uh, okay, I think I know what you're talking about. Like uh, rare sort of parts, yeah. Yeah, they're viscera thing, you know? Yes. Um, I can look around, and if I find one, I can get it too. I mean, I assume you need just one, right? Or is it multiple? Uh, one per bag, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, I'll talk around. Maybe try Wainwright if he pops up today. Um, and if you need... Ooh, um, that's fair. If you need a hand fronting money, I got plenty, so... Cool. Yeah, I don't really know what the price this thing is, because, like, sure. I don't know how much that part is gonna cost, so... <laughs> yeah. But I was gonna get all the other resources in the meantime, at least. Okay, yeah. Uh, let me know if you need a hand with any of that, and I'll see what I can do. I'll keep my ear open for anything rare and party. Sounds good. Okie dokie. Why, why is the... Why do you have a fish hiding? What fish? Where? <laughs> Are you okay, Torty? <laughs> is the fish in the room with us now? <laughs> well... <laughs> We're not in that room. Not yet. We already established that I'm, I'm like... Oh. Hi. No loitering. <laughs> okay. He does nice to see it. you, Captain. Let me know if you need anything with the tavern, okay? Will do. So far, so good, though. Yep. See you around. Just in it for the coin. No, I mean uh, something new every day. Something say coin. Well, he's helped before. <laughs> oh no, the coin cousin well, just offered me free material. <clears throat> you know, he's helped before. Yes. Sir. Do you know how to look after a baby? Yes. Well, who's? Ah, uh, the baby. The baby. <laughs> the baby. You mean um? Yes. She might be staying here with us tonight. He's not confident in his ability to take care of her anymore. And since I yeah, promised to take care of her... When she's in the grove. Okay, thank you. Yeah. So I won't be completely by myself. I've looked at her before. No, I was, if you made her formula out of milk and everything like that she needs, so I've, I've tended to her before. You might have to teach me a few things. I'm woefully unprepared to preserving life. It's quite simple. You'll get used to it fast. Oh. We don't have a crib, right? We have like a box. I can't imagine so. We could could we just build something out of these rocks and like put like a blanket over it or something? I would recommend a crate over rocks. That's such a <laughs> good idea. It could be very more, damaging. More 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 than likely when I lay down, I will lay her on top of my breast and she'll sleep with. Okay. God, I wish it was a baby again. Baby, <laughs> babies. Oh my God. I don't. Babies <laughs> tend to like being next to the mother's heart. Do they? I would. I wouldn't know. Yes. Okay, yeah. so let's see here. What I need you to do when you find O'Shawn is I already roll for it, so go find. Go find me six moon seashoe and four Herrera grass. Yep. I'll definitely it's remember for, that. It's for making anti-poisons. Mm-hmm. We'll Com figure we need to stock up to on that memory. more than anything because, because of what we're having to deal with. Okay, I can go look from now if one of you is okay to stay here and look after her. Um, sure. And also Soma oh, as well. You wanted uh, testing kits, mm. correct? Yeah, or to find out what he needs to make them. Okay. We'll do that now if then. If he has any in stock, or here's you the list. This is for Oshon? Yes. Okay. Alright, we'll be back soon. Scream if you need us. <laughs> sure. Oh no. He shall I need to invest in like a whistle. Why? <laughs> uh, 
what, like the one that Miss oh, Claudia brought I would recommend informing your father when able about the instant things I saw last night. I'm sure. Us. Like well, with all already roof hoppers this late in the evening, he was he already knew about the fires. He wished to know more, be more alerted when things like that happen. I'll see if he's around. Sure, if you need anything from Mr. Wainwright, I think I can facilitate uh, that. Have you ever even spoken to Wainwright? I mean, that's a good idea, a whistle. I have. I've never Several seen you times. two speak. I bought a halberd from him. Sounds like a conflict of interest to me. Yeah, that's where he, I got my steel shield from. He, he, he kind of talks like this. He's all, he's all <sighs> taught me. I would have killed for a set of steel armor. Better repair arms no, first. You can't have I, oh, I didn't hear that. If you hand me money, I'm sure I can go. Hmm. He's probably resting. Ugh, he would need it after all the money went through. It's the only reason I'm not constantly bugging him about things that we can handle ourselves. Oh, did you read the report I mean, Marcus and uh, worked on last night? I skimmed it and then sent it straight up to him. Mm. Do you have any amendments? How much for... Recommendations if you want to change anything for your own activities, as it were. Oh? She's staying down there. Well, any points of... Uh... Maybe an easily yeah, open so door that's more uh, or a wall that looks yeah, like a wall so outside than inside, so yeah. to speak. So how much oh, more plush is gonna you cost? What do you think about getting Tang to dig an escape tunnel out. out of the basement? And then I have to go ask Miss uh, Marin. It would be loud. Uh, hmm. um, I guess more. Well, there is intended inst uh, well, be done. construction out here, and remember, they are constructing on the walls too. Perhaps it's could be covered. I would say it could be easily done. If we're so close to the walls, it wouldn't be an issue, and I don't expect us to run into anything. I'll run it by on. But that is the question of it does leave a possibility of a entry point. Only if people know about it. Mm. But you are right, that's why I was concerned about <laughs> opening up extra doors. No movement. Must be out and about. Next stop is Soma. Well, well precautionaries can be put in place. Uh, tunnel collapsing maneuvers and whatnot to ensure that it wouldn't be a problem. Simple traps that can cause a yeah, very much a cascading effect. That's enough. Them damn dead beats! Alright, I'm gonna get them. <clears throat> get them, get them. Coin brothers? Coin. Wait. Is it coin or maybe silver? Silver ogle? A dog really likes to slide. It's everybody. it's so strange. I don't, okay, it wasn't just me. I thought it was my eyes. Mm. Yeah, mm. okay. It's no, it's, it, it's marking its territory everywhere with its <coughs> uh, buttocks. I should get the guard. They're gonna run from me again like last time. Now this doesn't Don't let this don't let this get out too far, but the the wolf is Can I oh, 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 o
was. Oh, yeah. no, it looks like you're you know, weird. 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 you saw them walking you that way. Mm. Maybe we no. should. I mean, I said we took the long way. <laughs> My lord. <laughs> Evening. Uh, looking for Soma. If you guys have seen him. Um, He's not in the clinic. Mm, I know that. Mm. He was with Basil. He was having breakfast with her on upon her request. I do have things I would like to say to you, but I can wait if you have business. Good morning, Lord Erhart. One of your staff sergeants came and fetched me. You're wearing brown. Yes, I need to talk to you about Venora. I need to be brought to Christine on why she was arrested. I'm hearing rumors, and I need to hear it from people who were there. Would you mind? Parents have made it very clear it's a closed matter, mother. I'm not the sort of a guard sergeant. To re -grand opening of the tavern. Drinks are on me for the next hour. What? what? Would you at least I confirm with me that I know our good close? friend would not do this? Are you, are you, are you going senile? <laughs> I completely believe in Miss Fedora's innocence. He got hit yesterday in the head. Leave it. As do I. Thank you for your input. That is all. Okay. <laughs> If they change their mind, there is a small council meeting today. Then I shall be in attendance. Apologies. I saw Soma sneak off. Where are they? I'm gonna step away for a second. I'm gonna take a moment. Morning. Morning. What was that lady with the boy? Sides. I have no immediate desire to just make new friends. No, no, I only care about. Fucking walked off here. That. A human and an elf. <clears throat> How fucking quick can they be? Really? Well, you'd be surprised how fast people can be when they have somewhere to go. Oh, <laughs> Miss Basil outran me once while she was in heels. Oh, women are extraordinary creatures. <laughs> There is a knocking at the front door. Sounds like people are in there. Mm -hmm. oh, that's good news. Hopefully not on an impromptu time. Soma, do you have a moment? <sighs> oh shit. Um... Me and Basil is just now uh, doing a few other things back 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 inside, and then I'll be with the both of you. Can you uh, stay out here for about another minute or so? It only takes you a minute. <sighs> It'll only be a minute. It'll only be a minute. I think it went over his head. Mm, yes, quite fast. Fast as nutter in the west. <clears throat> <clears throat> Soma, the quick shot. <laughs> no one ever sees him coming. Hip fire Soma, that's what we call him. <laughs> I heard you. I hit you. Weapon? Me. Think. You. It. Sword. Me. Remember? Teach. Ah. I'll have to bring it up with noses, but I'll be happy to teach you. I can get you up to a militia-ish standard. Yep. 
I'll run it by knowledge next time I see her. There's a small council meeting today I might be a part of, so if she's there. Special delivery. For the house? Yes. Do you want to let him in? All right. <clears throat> Almost died. Yes, I'll let him in. I'll just take the delivery, actually. <sighs> I need to talk to her as well, real quick. Do you permit it? Yes, you know the rules, though. All right. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt things between you two. Um, it's it's fine. Can we go inside. Um, different place for now. <laughs> no, no, I think you'd be good. With who's all right. What are you two doing? All right, all right. Come along in. I gave you the key, right? Making me worried. You would see on our bed, Clifford's baby. <clears throat> yeah, he was going to give it to me tonight to look after, but... No one knows about this corner in the wall, except for the Inquisitor with the mask and the Major. If no one really you're knows. okay to look after it and protect her, then... I am her godparent, after all. Then it's a good thing you know where she is. Yeah. I'd look after her myself, but with what's happening right now, I can't. Speaking of which, I just need a small request from you. On behalf of one of our friends. What might that be? I need to get my hands on some poison testing kits, or at least the resources to, to make them. It needs to be done discreetly. I feel like I shouldn't ask, and I only have one. You don't know how to make more, or...? I only have one. Where to get more? Well, no. Because of the war that's been going on, I had to keep making bandages and stitch gauzes and splints, all that other shit. But, as for supplies, considering how busy that I am, those things are actually extremely hard to come by due to how busy I am, but I have something written down here for a few of the ways on how to make them. Just have to be have to bring them to me if anything. Okay. Oh, uh, we've got uh, surgical gauze, mm -hmm. stereo stitching instructions. Mm -hmm. Stair stitching poison testing kits. Here it is. There's two ways to make it. First way, anything smaller wooden. Or in a much more specific sense, I would need four fibers, one charcoal, and one herograss. The second way of making it is four fibers, one charcoal, and one sanitizer. So only be two different ways. I already have five sanitizer on me. We can get the materials. Charcoal and the fibers are what's up. Are you the only person that can make them? We'd have to take them to you though, right? <clears throat> Definitely. And if needed to be done discreetly, then it have to be in a place that we all know can be kept safe. However, I will say, as much as I'd want to try and make them here, with what we have right now, 
Absolutely I not. I do not want to ever come near to chancing that. Um, if you write down what we need to get, I'll take them to who can, and then when we have the supplies, I'll get them to you, and you can figure out what to do from there. I'll just rewrite what I have. What do I have from the original list in this book here, and then I can give that straight to you. <clears throat> I appreciate it. Oh, where's that other thing? There it is. Actually. Glad to see he made it back in one piece. In a way. Fibers. He's tired. Charcoal and herograss and fibers. With everything that he went through, I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah. I'm just glad that with everything that happened, I can take the load off his shoulder a little bit now. Now they know how to be a lord and such. I told you, didn't I? That you'd make a good lord? And you act like him enough? Thank you, Basil. And thank yeah, you so much. Everything that you need to know when it comes to the supplies. Actually, and since you are here, something that I need to ask for you. Uh, this. You'll see as he pulls out a very worn iron dagger. All it needs would be repair. I can do that, no problem. It'll be done by tomorrow. I'm assuming to give it to you right now, then? Yeah. Thanks. Come by tomorrow. It'll be done. We'll, uh, call it even Understood. for this favor. thank you. <laughs> of course, of course. Alright. I'll get out of your head. <sighs> As for... As for the discretion of the ma of the making of these testing kits, whether by your home or somewhere else that isn't visited too much too often. Can't Not be yet. my home. Maybe the apothecary. Then the apothecary it is. Okay. Yeah. Once I get you the stuff, we can work on that. Let me know if you need any help with. Understood. Anything. I will. Thanks, guys. <clears throat> Sorry for interrupting. No problem. You're, no, you're okay. fine, you're fine. Food well, not yet. You know, oh, there you are. I just ran right all there. over town for you. I went into the building oh we were outside of. With the kids, I was uh, certain. Did you get a cost or anything? And I hate to disturb him again. I got a list of what we would need. There's two different recipes he can do it oh, with. But... And he'll need somewhere to work on it over time. He suggested here, I said no, and then I suggested the apothecary might be the best place. Since we're doing it discretion. Just... Uh... Did you say out loud what he Six mean? moon something or other, four Herrera grass. Uh... No, sorry. They've written this really weirdly. Uh, four fibers, one charcoal, and one Herrera yeah. grass. Or, one sanitizer. To make the kit. Oh shit! One sanitizer to make a kit? Well, uh, instead of the Herrera grass, I believe. Oh, okay. So, uh, here, let me jot this down real quick. Sure. Hmm. I don't know if you ate yet, but I brought. Okay, you said Herrera? You won. Uh, four Herrera grass. That's good. Sorry. Four fiber. Oh. 
Oh, four fiber. Okay, four. Let me see. Four fiber. Four fiber. Okay. okay. I would insist, my lord. You do need to eat. When I'm not busy. One charcoal. Hmm. One char. Okay. This basil did make it. And one Herrera grass or <laughs> one sanitizer. That's good. Oh, good. I have all that in stock. If you want, I can get those supplies to him immediately. Okay. Um, yeah, I can pack up a, a crate. Um, if you can get me six common visceras. Six. Find out what they cost, Ooh. at least. Find out what the market value is. Okay. If they don't have any in stock, that's fine. Or if they have only one or two, that's fine. Just six is the top one I need, but, you know. But check with the hunters first, uh -huh. with uh, Lorelei and Miss um... Sigvana. Yeah, Sigvana. Big bitch. Will do. Of course. <laughs> All right, let me get you that crate real quick. And I will. Well, I can get you a don't reasonable you price of this. Don't sir. you love this fetch quest mm -hmm. simulator? <laughs> Honestly, I it, it's better than sitting in this room all day like you have to do. I do not envy you. Mm. Well, well, the pleasant thing is, they can go up onto the balcony. As long as there. No, snipers, Miss President, Ooh, stay away from the balcony. I wouldn't allow it. Well, that's what, what? I'm there for, to save the President. <laughs> Get down, Mr. God. President. Faye gets up into the balcony, just this red dot. We already had to go through that. Not again. Every time. Uh, <laughs> yeah. glass from some of these buildings, I swear. <laughs> Make strange reflections. <laughs> okay, let's see your full fibers, so... <clears throat> uh, da, da, da. Okay, so I'm gonna make four, so that's... Give me one second here. Oh, I'm gonna total the amount I'm gonna give you here. 25 copper per. 